So what we spoke to, you know, Invesco and Morgan Creek Digital, and they said the factors behind Bitcoin are actually very similar to gold. So the rise in U.S.-China trade tensions, lower rates, investors in general trying to diversify their portfolio as stocks sit near record highs. What's interesting is, though, since Facebook announced Libra on Tuesday of last week, you've seen Bitcoin gain 40 percent year wow. to date, now up over 250 percent. So that's really prompted this larger debate. Is this rally, this rebound in 2019 different than what we saw in 2017? So a couple of things. One is, are there more ATMs and retailers using Bitcoin or allowing co consumers to transact with Bitcoin? No. I didn't think so. I rarely ever see it. Institutional investor participation, that has been on the rise. Mm -hmm. If you talk to Fidelity, which has $7.2 trillion in assets, they are actually one of the few asset managers that allows clients to trade Bitcoin on their platform. Um, they will tell you that there, are, there is more interest from larger high net worth clients, family offices, pension funds as well. So that is different pension this funds. year versus 2017. And another thing I would say is the market structure is also developing. You had Ledger X getting that approval from the CFTC. So and that was retail maybe. investors could get now more trade access. Derivatives. Yeah. Crazy.